Kyra, did you do the dishes? Kyra. What? Can't hear you, Mom. Dishes. Not yet. What's the hurry? It's not like we're having visitors ever again. Oh, <laughs> visitors, cool. So are you staying for dinner? There's rice and um, stale bread and the beef jerky my uncle made back in the 90s. He's never been able to sell it. Can't imagine why. Kyra. I have to apologize for my daughter, but it's not an easy situation for any of us. We're all going a bit crazy in here. I always thought that if we protected the land, if we played our part and did our duty, the land would protect us. So either that was all bullshit, or we haven't held up our side of the bargain. Yeah, if we could all just get along like a proper family, instead of bickering about who said what to whom like 40 years ago then maybe we wouldn't be stuck here with nothing to eat except canned meat and peas. That's the price we pay for disunity and discord. But the land is strong and will fight back. Given a chance, we just need to harness that strength. So what are you waiting for, Mom? Go out there and, like, harness. Beat sitting here eating baked beans. Oh yeah, there's also baked beans. For breakfast, lunch, dinner, and midnight snack. <laughs> it's surprisingly awful. It's not as simple as that, Kyra. I wish it were, but we're alone. I can't do this on my own. We need help. In the meantime, we have to care about the little things, like the chores. So will you please do the dishes? Fine. Fine! If the monsters eat us, at least they'll be using clean plates.